Bitcoin new all-time high guys like I promised you a new all-time high in this week I also made another promise I promise you when we make a new all-time high I will jump into the pool I will make a bombages as we say it in the Netherlands And I will do that at the end of the video I will jump in the pool because we had a new all-time high in Bitcoin today's video of course, looking at the news, as Trump is probably winning the elections, 99% sure already that he's won. He has like 266 points at the moment. I think he will go to 270 very soon. Bam, new president, Bitcoin president, setting Ross Ulbricht free. All of the news, of course, Bitcoin charts, a couple of them, and an inspirational quote, and a jump of me into the pool. BTC, let's run. Now, let's quickly jump into the first part, the news. Bam. The news for today, guys, of course, the elections. I've been telling you all week, I think that Trump is going to win. And I think when Trump wins, it's really good for Bitcoin. It's going to pump Bitcoin all the way up to 85 to 90K levels between now and the end of December. And then, of course, I'm going to warn you already now. And now maybe you start to believe me because I was right all the time. In January, we'll see a dip. Maybe even from 90K back to 70K you will be there prepared to buy the dip and then the last part of the bull market will start all the way into 2025 when we will make a new all-time high let me know down below if you are happy that trump won the elections let's just pretend he already won i think he already won uh, because i think he's demolishing the amount of votes if you look at kamala i'm so happy for the world that the war will end and of course he made a few promises. Ross Ulbricht will be set free. Finally, this guy that sits in the prison because he made a product, a marketplace where people could pay with Bitcoin. And because he accepted payments in Bitcoin on that marketplace, he went lifetime into jail. Trump said, when I become president, I will set him free on day one. So let's see if he will keep his promise because I think that's a very important promise that he made. And Ross Ulbricht did a really big step for Bitcoin adoption when it came to payments. So yes, we we need to set Ross free. Of course, also congratulations to the family of Ross because I know her mother traveled all over the world to all the crypto events just to talk to all crypto people all over the world to set Ross free, guys. Yes, this is finally maybe gonna happen. And finally, Trump will probably end all of the wars, which will mean people will again become more stable. The world will become more stable. And when the world will become more stable, people again lose the fear of unstable economies and will start to invest more, which is of course also very positive for Bitcoin because then people will trust Bitcoin a little bit more because they don't think the world is gonna collapse in World War III or whatever epidemic that's gonna happen. They then trust, hey, it's gonna be a stable situation. America is stopping the wars because Trump is the new president. Now it's time again to start to invest a little bit more. And that is how retail gets sucked into Bitcoin again at those prices around 80K. While they should have been listening to me and buying around 16K or the time before at 3K or the time before still below 1K, guys. I'm very happy. I'm very excited. Not only that Trump is going to win, but also that we made a new all-time high for Bitcoin today. That's the news for today. Let's quickly jump now into the charts to show you exactly what I expect next for Bitcoin. Bitcoin. And bam, yes guys, a new all-time high. And let me show you something really cool on this four-hour chart. We exactly hit that green line that I drew there a couple of days ago in my video. I thought, you guys, that is going to be the line that we will create a new all-time high. Exactly, 75,200, that was a new all-time high. We are crashing back now. Probably we will fall back to this green line because mostly when we break certain resistance levels, we go up, we come down, and then again the move up, something like that. And yes, if we don't keep support over here, we can even fall down lower to these levels of support over there, guys. But at the moment, Bitcoin looking really crazy cool. A new Ultima, congratulations all of you. And um, let me show you something else. At the moment, I'm recording this video, uh, at the moment, Trump is leading with 266 points against 195 of Kamala Harris. I think when he reaches 270 points, um, he will be officially announced as the winner. So let's see how long that will take. But I think, um, yeah, I think it's pretty sure that Trump will win. I can't see anything happening that Kamala Harris is still going to uh, take over 70 points now from Trump. So yes, uh, that's very positive for crypto, of course, guys. Now, let's zoom out a little bit to the weekly chart. Also in this weekly chart, I showed you already uh, where we are at the moment. We, I told you guys 
those green bars on the bottom, when that started to happen, I told you that is very bullish over there. That's the green circle. I said the bars will become bigger and bigger and bigger. I also told you, if we look back in history, I showed it you in this chart, to be very honest, over there. If we look back in history, every time when we went from red to green, we made a huge run into Bitcoin, 30K, 60K, 90K runs. I have shown you all of this. I told you when we break out, we will follow this green line. I told you last video that that hammer candle there is a bullish candle, not a bearish candle. And now we can see how bullish it is as it's hitting this candle up until a new autumn high at the moment rsi creeping up slowly beautiful charts guys amazing day for bitcoin a new autumn high on the 6th of november in 2024 now let's quickly jump into three more amazing charts that i want to share with you today the first one being this one over here is my face okay yes it's mckay research i found this one on twitter um, another chart that will show you Every time when the elections were over here, it was Obama on the 6th of November 2012. Bitcoin went up with 10,400 percent. Trump in uh, November 8, 2016, Bitcoin went up with 2,600 percent. Then we had Biden, yes, the most uh, hated president ever. <laughs> Even when he went to, uh, became president, we had a 360 percent move. So let's say that today Trump will win or Kamala. I still believe it's going to be Trump. Uh, we will only move up 145%. Only 145%. Not even half of what we did previous cycle. If we would do that, then the Bitcoin price would turn into 180,000 US dollar. That would be the peak. At the moment, 74,000 US dollar on election day, plus 145%. 180,000 US dollar. That's a little bit above my target. My target is between 120 and 160,000 US dollar. But I really like the calculation that they did on the chart. If you want to analyze it a little bit more, pause the video and do your calculations, guys. But this is awesome to see. Next chart is this one. This one is also showing you how it works, the price performance around the halvings, before the halving, after the halving. For those that don't understand, the halving is here at date zero. For before the halving, we go from here to 60 days, one year before the halving, all the way into the halving, mostly creating a beautiful higher price than when we were a year before. Now, after the halving, what we always do is one year of bullishness. We have now 170 to 80 days of bullishness already behind us at the level of 2.09 from the halving, which is beautiful. Um, now we are going to go and see how far can we take this. Can we take this to the 9 and the 8 level or only to the 6 level? It is still, if we go to the 6 level, this level times 3. 60 times 3 is 180k, same target, same target. Amazing target for Bitcoin, 160, 180k. That is where I advise you guys to really keep watching my videos because I will tell you that probably to sell and take your profits into a stable coin to buy the Bitcoin dip back at the bear market bottom. And a lot of people at that moment will be telling you it's going to go to 500k, 600k. You can also choose to follow them. All good to me. I will be taking profit. And if you don't, I am still your friend. But, you know, a little bit more profit than you probably have. Now, okay, then we go to the last chart. This is an amazing chart. I found this one today also on Twitter. Chaikin Molly Flow Bull Runs. Yeah, there's uh, the, the name of the chart. We can see those one, two, three numbers. So we can see the green line on the bottom. We can see exactly when the bull run bounce was there. Like you have the red dot, another red dot, then that green bounce. And then, of course, another blue bounce over there. So red dot, red dot, green downs. This is what we happens, what happens every time during these markets. Just check this complete chart. Just pause the video and analyze it for yourself. At the moment, we just saw that bull run bounce. The same bounce that we saw over there, the same bounce that we saw over there, the same bounce that we saw over there. This bounce has a history led every time to a new all-time high, guys. So the red dots, we fail to retest. The green dots, that's the bull run bounce. And the blue dot, that's a double top bounce that we had only once over there in the previous bull market. Yeah, 2013, they calculated the double top. Okay. Now, over here, we are now at level one. We're going to go into this green box because of the bounce. We're going to bounce to level two and to level three. Will it be level two and then a dip and a level three almost as high as level two? That's all possible. 
My guess is this is gonna end somewhere between 120 and 160,000 US dollar. And that is exactly what I've been telling you from the beginning of this bull market. I told you from the beginning, I don't believe in three and 500K, that is my target. I kept calling this target, I never switched to another target. I only told you that other people had higher targets, that I could be very conservative, but for me, that is the target. 160 is for me a beautiful bull market top, guys. I hope you really enjoyed the charts, guys. When it comes to the Bitcoin charts, it's very simple. Zoom out. Look at that four-year cycle. Every four years, your Bitcoin price will be higher than the four years before. If you buy Bitcoin today, around 75K, four years later, it will be higher than 75K. If you buy Bitcoin during the bear market bottom, for example, next bear market bottom around 60K, whatever, then four years later than that, again, the bear market bottom will be higher. Whatever you do, as long as you hodl Bitcoin longer than four years, and that is, of course, why I started with this one, as long you hodl Bitcoin longer than four years, you will always be in profit. Don't look at all the volatile movements on the day chart, on the five minute chart, on the one minute chart. Don't give a fuck about that because you're not a trader, you're an investor, you're protecting your capital against inflation, and that is why you invest in Bitcoin. And you hodl it for longer than four years, you will be in profit. Even the people that bought the previous top, the previous top, they are now in profit. If they just held from 2021 to 2024, they are now already in profit. And they are not even at the end of this bull market. They will be in shitloads of more profits at the end of the bull market. So zoom out, look at the bigger picture, zoom in, try to enjoy every single minute of life. That is way more important. Life is more important than Bitcoin. Yes, you heard it right. Now, let's jump now into the inspirational quote to end the video. Bam. I am gonna make it a very short but powerful quote, guys, because a lot of people stress way too much. Stress about everything in life. And there is one quote that I really like, and that's a simple one. Don't worry, be happy. Stop worrying about all that stuff that you don't have any influence on. Don't worry. Just put your energy in being happy. Simple as that. I love the song, don't worry, be happy. You know that one? I just keep repeating it throughout my videos that I make already for a couple of years. You should be focused on being happy instead of worrying. Don't worry, be happy. It's very simple. You can worry about all those things that you can't influence, like the weather, or like the economy, or whatever else it is. You can worry a shitload about it, but you can't influence it, you can't change it. So just focus on being happy. Focus on those things that you can influence and that will make you happy. That is what you should be doing in life. Stop worrying, start focusing on being happy, guys. I'm gonna jump now into the pool because I'm very happy that Bitcoin made a new all-time high, and of course also because I always do what I say and say what I do, and I made you the promise when we will surpass Bitcoin with a 75K new all-time high, I told you guys, I'm gonna make a bombage. I don't even know how to say this in English, but a bombage means that you're gonna jump into the pool and try to make a big as possible splash. That's what I'm gonna to try to do to end this amazing video. Then I will come back and ask you again to subscribe to the channel, like the video, of course, uh, leave a comment, of course, share with your friends and family, all of that stuff. I will do it again, but first, the bombage that I promised. Give me one second. And there we go, guys. We go for the bombage. Bombage, Bitcoin bombage, guys. That was the Bitcoin bombage. I hope you can still hear me. I hope the camera is not too wet. Uh, it was an amazing bombature. Like promise, guys, the bombature. This is what we call a bomb in the Netherlands. Uh, I hope you really enjoyed today's video. If you did enjoy the video, give the video a thumbs up, share it with your friends and family, subscribe to the channel, hit the notification bell, and leave a comment. Congratulations, all of you guys, with a new all time high in Bitcoin. I wish you an amazing day. See you tomorrow again in another video. Probably then I will keep it dry. I'm not going to do another bombature at the next all time high. Bam!